Welcome to Medicam YouTube. Before we dive into today's topic, don't forget to like, share, subscribe and hit that bell icon for the latest updates from Medicam YouTube. Today I'll be talking about cuterebra, cutaneous maggot myosis infestation and conducting a live extraction. Alright, let's start with some basics. Cuterebra cutaneous myosis is caused by the larvae of the cuterebra botfly. The adult botfly lays its eggs near animal nests or on vegetation. When a host, usually a small mammal or sometimes a human, brushes against these eggs, they hatch into larvae. These larvae then penetrate the skin through hair follicles or small wounds. Once inside, they create a small cavity, known as a warble, where they develop. This warble appears as a red, inflamed, and often painful swelling. A small breathing hole remains in the skin, allowing the larva to get oxygen. The main symptoms include a boil-like lesion, itching, tenderness, and localized pain. You might even feel or see movement within the lesion as the larva grows. Sometimes fluid drains from the hole, which can lead to secondary bacterial infections. Now let's talk about complications. If the larva dies inside the skin or isn't removed properly, it can cause an intense inflammatory response leading to tissue damage and infection. In rare cases, the larvae can migrate to other tissues causing more severe symptoms. So what's the treatment? The most common treatment is the careful manual removal of the larva through the breathing hole. If the larva isn't visible, small surgical incisions may be necessary. Another method is to cover the breathing hole with petroleum jelly or adhesive tape, forcing the larva to the surface due to lack of oxygen. Antibiotics may also be used to treat or prevent secondary infections, and proper wound care is essential after removal. For prevention, in endemic areas, keep pets indoors and avoid rodent-infested environments. For humans, taking precautions in rural or wooded areas where cuterebra botflies are common can minimize the risk of infestation. Cuterebra cutaneous myosis is more frequently seen in rural or warm regions, especially where rodents and small mammals are abundant. Please leave a thoughtful comment about the video and let me know your thoughts. Thanks for watching Medicam YouTube.